Hey guys, so I want to show what happens when you have a loose gyroscope in combat. Uh, so the way I'm gonna test this is that I have a gyroscope here. It's very loosely attached to the armor, the light armor. And I'm gonna explode this warhead, which is gonna make the gyroscope loose. So I'm gonna explode the warhead here just to show you guys. Uh, armor head building. Alright, so you see the warhead will not be destroyed in the explosion, but it's gonna start floating in the ship. Alright, so we're gonna load the game now, and we're gonna see what happens if that happens in the middle of combat when you're maneuvering your ship. Alright, so we're back now. I'm gonna arm the warhead, and then I'm gonna get into the flight seat and start flying. I mean, I'm gonna start the countdown. Alright, starting the countdown now, and I'm gonna maneuver the ship as if I'm in combat, right? So I'm just going up here, and like moving around, and whoops! Oh! Yeah. So. You see the horrible effect of having a loose warhead in your ship? Alright, so that's the effect of one gyroscope. Now imagine if you have a group of gyroscopes put together in like an area that's like very weak and not well protected, then it's gonna cause a chain reaction that would possibly destroy your whole engine section, right? So that's why you don't want to like do that, right? You don't want to put gyroscopes together close to each other, especially on light armor. It's just a bad idea. And you know how people usually say hydrogen tanks explode and explode everything around it? Uh, that's not usually what happens. What usually happens is that there's a gyroscope attached to the to that hydrogen tank and when that hydrogen tank got destroyed, it made the gyroscope loose and it destroys the whole things around it. Alright, so that's why, <laughs> that's why you don't want to have a loose gyroscope in your ship. Just put them on something strong and make sure they are not grouped together.